Welcome back guys for another episode of Cooking with Charlie. Alright, today I'm going to make some tilapia with a Mexican salsa over white jasmine rice. Alright, it's going to be fantastic. My mom loves this meal and my wife does also. The kids, uh, they're not really seafood either, so they'll pass on the fish. Alright, so first off, what you're going to need, you're going to need tilapia, you're going to need rice, and you can either buy some salsa, which I prefer not to do. But I will show you how to make the pico de gallo salsa. First what we have here, we have our two tilapia fillets. We have a mixture of garlic powder, uh, onion powder, and chili powder. What I'm going to use on top of it. We got our salt and we got our pepper. Uh, exact measurements we have uh, probably just all you need is a pinch of salt, pinch of pepper, and just mix together as much onion powder, garlic powder, and uh, chili pepper, chili powder as you want. I just mix it in here. If I use it, I use it. If I don't, I don't. Our special ingredient right here is Maggi. It's hot chili. All right. It's not really spicy, spicy to me, but it, it gives you that extra layer of flavor to all of your food. Then finally, while we're cooking, we'll cut these lim lemons. Squeeze it on there so we can get that lemon flavor in the fish. Alright, so this is what we got to do. A little bit of salt. A little bit of pepper. I'm going to flip them over do the same thing. Take a little bit of this. I'm not, it doesn't seem like I'm putting a lot of seasoning on here. Don't worry because you're not going to need a lot you're still going to get that flavor. We have some olive oil. We already preheated the pan. We're going to put about a teaspoon of olive oil in there. Let's mix this around. When we put this fish in here, we want it to, to get brown and look real pretty. First piece of fish. And our second piece of fish in there. Let's let this cook for a little bit. Probably around three minutes per side. And it'll be done. We're going to pull it off. Hopefully our rice is done by then. And then uh, I'll show you how to make the salsa. And I'll show you a beautiful plate after we're done. Alright, now it's time to add in the Maggi. To give it that extra layer of flavor. Let's add the Maggi to it. Remember... You can uh, add it liberally because it's not going to be really spicy. It just gives you more flavor. After we add the Maggi, we want to flip the fish over. Oh, look at that. Nice. All right. We're going to let it finish cooking on this side. It's almost done. So I'm going to squeeze this lemon on it. Get this juice. I got my hand underneath because I don't want any seeds to fall in. There we go. I'm going to let it cook in that lemon juice for about a minute because it's probably pretty much done right now. And now let's make some salsa. In this bowl, I have two whole diced Roma tomatoes. I have about a quarter bunch of cilantro. And I have a half of white onion and a whole serrano chili. I put that in the food processor and I chopped it up very good. So what we're going to do, first we're going to get about half of half of the half of an onion just mix that up pretty good then we're going to get all the cilantro because I love cilantro if you don't like cilantro you can do it however you want mix that up looks pretty now it looks like salsa let's add a little bit of salt if you want more salt, you can add more salt. And then the last thing I'm going to do, I'm going to squeeze the juice from this lemon. Alright, let's mix this up. And it's going to be the bomb. There we go. Our salsa is ready and it's going to be on standby. Alright, we got our rice on the plate. I'm going to take my tilapia. Place it on the plate, nice and neat. Scrap the other piece, 
place up here alongside. And we got both pieces of tilapia on there. We're gonna top it with the salsa. Use as much as you like. I'm gonna squeeze a lemon on here, a little extra flavor. For garnish, I got a couple of radishes. Just throw them on a the plate, make them look nice. If you like them, you eat them. If you don't, you just leave them there. Spread a little bit of parsley around. And there is your plate. Hey guys, thanks for joining me for another episode of Cooking with Charlie. It's been a pleasure having you in my kitchen. Remember this dish? It is the tilapia with jasmine rice with the Mexican salsa on there. And Check out my Instagram at Dream Big Cooking. Remember that? Dream big. Alright? And till next time, I'll see you again with another great recipe and meal for you. I ain't a chef. But I'm a damn good cook. Till next time.